Hey everyone, my name is Tariq Brown and I'm a software engineer at Microsoft. And today I'm gonna to walk you through how to get started with formatting in the C++ extension for VS Code. Now in the C++ extension, you have a few options for formatting. If you go to your settings and you just type in format, you should see in the drop down menu here, various different settings. But what you care about is the settings in the C++ extension. So this is assuming that you've gone to the extensions page and you've installed the Microsoft official C++ extension. Once you've done so, when you go to your settings, you're going to see the C++ formatting settings. Now, there are two main ways that formatting is supported in the C++ extension. There's Clang format and VC format. Clang format is a third-party software that is commonly used to format C++ files. If you haven't used a Clang format file before, it's pretty simple. All you're going to do is go to the project that you're working on and create a dot cling format file. Now for these settings to be picked up by the extension, they have to be either in the parent directory or the current directory that you're working in. Once you have the cling format file set up, then in the corresponding directory that you have it set, the extension should pick up the format settings. So for example, let's say in our clang format file, we want to use an indent width of 20. Now when I click save here, and set the indent width to 20 and come back to this file, we should see some pretty large indentations. As you can see, we're now using the settings that correspond to the clang format file. What I would encourage you to do is just explore the documentation for clang format there's all different ways you can set up to format your project. Formatting is really good because you can create a consistent coding style throughout your projects and don't have to really worry about how you're formatting because once you have a certain style down, then you can just hit the format button. Now, the other way to format your files in C++ is using the VC format engine. Now this is actually really cool because a lot of people requested this. This is actually the same formatting engine that's used in Visual Studio. Now what's really cool is that all the settings and change for formatting are actually under the C++ settings for the extension. So if you go down here, you can scroll through and there's so many, so many different settings that you can select in order to change the formatting. And this is really just gonna give you the most control over what exactly you want your code to look like and however granular you would like to get. And for example, we can just pick a setting, I'm trying to find a good setting here that we can easily see. If we were to go um, here, we have place else on a new line and we have that checked. So if we go back here and we just have an if else statement on the same line, and we hit format on our document, it should place on a new line. Boom. And all of the other settings are, all the other formatting is coming from the different settings we have set. Yeah, those are the two ways you can go about setting up your formatting in your C++ projects in VS Code. Hope you enjoyed the video. Comment below, let me know what you'd like to see next, and subscribe and like if this helped you out. Peace.